Okay, so once you're done exporting your file from Potter Structure, it is now time for you to now perform your full structural detailing. So right now, let me just show you the exported file that we have just brought out from Potter Structure. So I'll just go and locate that from my um, document folder and then I'll open the Potter Structure folder and then open the file which was exported from Potter Structure. So now, as you can see, once this is done opening, you will see your exported file that came from Puta Structure. So right now, we are trying to now perform the full structural detailing. So right now, you can see that once you export your file from Puta Structure, which, which you are seeing right now, you will see that most of your um, drawing, this is, not how, um, a good, this is not how a good structural detailing is meant to look. As you can see it just now and if you go ahead to go and print out this drawing you will see that your drawing will, will not be that will not be that will not be that visible because um there is a way or there is, there is, there is what they call standard um structural detailing which um this software doesn't do that much but there is a customized template which is customized after you're done um performing your or performing or either exporting all your details from product structure and and there is a customized template called stonebridge company customized detailing template this template helps to perform a full structural detailing once you're done exporting your file from product structure okay so right now i'll just go and show you the file right now which we are going to use for this so i'll go to my download folder right now as you can see it here, Stonebridge, let me just um, open it up, Stonebridge Company Structural Detailing Template. So if you download that right now, it will be in a zip file. So all you have to do is just to un unzip that. So once you unzip that, then you will have this here. So let me just, um, sorry. So let me just copy this right now to um, a folder. Let me just copy it and paste it inside this potato folder right now and then unzip it here. So I'll just unzip this right now from this place. Extract. So once you extract, you you will not see this um this, you will not see this place called Stone um, Stonebridge Company Structural Detailing Template. So I'll just open it right now. So this template is like a customized template that helps to optimize and also um make your drawing make the make the time that you are meant to spend. On your structural detailing very very easy so once you open this template right now all you have to do is to go and copy this your Potter structural detailing details into that template so right now i will go and copy this right now into the stonebridge template file now once i paste that into that template file automatically it will go to change and rearrange everything to how it is meant to look like and it will help to reduce your workload to 80 percent and if you now go ahead and print your drawing from this stonebridge template you see how your drawing will like look like very very good but if you can print it directly from the Potter structure um um this thing detail it not look nice so right now i'll just go here and then um i'll just go and create my own um my, my own border side here and then right click here and then paste this into this place so i'll just click on here and then paste now once i paste it right now you can see that automatically it will change all um, everything to a standard method okay let's just hold on for it to paste so if i paste this right now to take some it take like some few um seconds to now change um everything automatically so let's just hold on for it to um change it's like um for me i i call it a magic template because it's very good and it and, and it works very fine with Potter structure okay so right now you can now see um what it has just done you can see what it has um performed fully magnify i can see that so if you open the other one which came from the software directly you can see what the software own looks like which is if you can print this directly right now from this it's not going to look nice but if you check what we have just done on this place right you can see how it has changed everything look at the old one here this is the old one and then this is the new one 
you, you can see how it has changed um, almost everything for you and also you can see how it has also, also uh, magnified all these other side too and then you can see how it has also um, shown this for you but before this is for how it looks like when you just came out from portal structure detail this is how it looks like and if you can print this directly it's not going to look nice but if you look at what we are we have what this with this template um, has done you can see how it has um, changed everything for you automatically let's do it again let me just copy again so let me just copy again and put and paste again so that you you will see how uh, it changed everything automatically so if i go again right now um magnif zoom this down so once you're done with your um design in putter structure you have to i would advise that you get this template so i'll drop the link to the template down on this video uh, on, on this video description so that you can um, get it from that um, from that link or you can also send us you can also send us a whatsapp message and then we will also guide you on how to get that template okay on uh, this template sorry so right now i'll go ahead and copy this again so once you're done with your with your design in putter structure i will say that you should copy your detail into this stonebridge company customized daily template which would lessen the which would lessen the time that you are meant to spend in your channel to, to at least 80 percent so right now once you come to this template i would say that you should create your own border because you will see existing drawing which with the company kept because with the company kept for you as you can see the logo here stonebridge as you can see it here stonebridge so there is an existing drawing which the company kept for you so you just have to create your own here and then once you create your own here your, your own border like this let me just erase that and then create again just create your own border like this so that you can know that that is your own so you go just go ahead right now and then right click here and then go to clipboard and then paste what you have copied from the portal structure into this template and it will um take a few seconds to now work on your social detailing to uh to 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 a very good one so right now just go ahead and paste it just now now once i paste it right now this template will automatically optimize the beam optimize the layout the columns and everything that you came with that that you came with from product structure into this template and if you go ahead and print from this um from if you guys and print your drawing right now from this place you see that your drawing will look very very good and very very presentable so right now you can you cannot see how it has turned everything to a standard way as you can see there you can see how it has turned it all to you but before this is what we have this before this is what you have when we are just done with the with the software put a structure but right now with the help of this template you can see how it has now magnified everything to to look very very nice and also i will show you in the next video how to now transfer all these your drawings right now to a template just like this let me show you just like this uh let it just come up so just like so this this um this stone bridge template is very very good so you can see you can also transfer your drawing from to, from that from from this model space right now into the template that there is also they have also placed a customized um template for you here so i can just go ahead right now and then double click here and then begin to zoom out where my drawing is as you can see it here so i can zoom it out right now and then place my bin inside this um, template so i'll show you how to place it also to look very very good so i'll show you in my next video how to work on this although although, although we have already worked on um on most of these things before but i will show you as you can see it here i'll show you how to how to do that just now which in my next video so you can also see the logo here stonebridge logo now i'll see that if you don't want this logo you can just take it off and then put in your own customized logo as you can see there but for now we'll be using this logo for now and then you can just change this place right now and put in your um put in your name my name is Justice, so I'll just go ahead and put in my name, Justice Omoka, just Justice. Sorry, I let me cut later. Justice. So you can see that 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 um, you can change all this place. You can also change the date again. This date, the, today's date is December 2022. So I'll put that. You can see that. So you can change all these things and also change the um, this project title, this project name. You can change that also. You can change the client's name or anything you want to change and put anything there, as you can see there. So you can make all these changes for yourself and then all that. And then if you go again and look at this template, this template also shows you how to, the reason why they put this sample here for you is to guide you on how to arrange your social drawing because most people don't know how to present their social drawing, but this template will help you out. As you can see there, for the first thing you have is your cover page, as you can see there, and then followed by your your general construction note and then you can see how they have guided you on how to arrange you can see uh, sheet one and you can see sheet two 
and you can see shade three. So, the, so they they guide they, they are going to guide you also how to um uh, how to arrange and present your structural drawings. So you can see that this um, this um company has really tried and also advanced a lot with um with the, with the help of this template. I think that this this company um put us torture should um should, should like try to um let me say um meet with this company and then um just to let me say that um um align with them so that they can be able to, so that, so that they can be able to, to, to like produce a good structural detail after they have done with your design because um this one that the software gave us put us structure is not really really nice as you can see there but this um company stonebury was able to now optimize and work on the tech on on their drawings and now produce a customized template for that okay so if you need to this um template right now i'll say you should click on the link down below and download that and then and then in my next video i'll also show you how to how to uh, how to use this stone bridge um customized template to now uh, to, to now perform our slab our slab detailing as you can see that we have a two type of slab here we have a lip slab as, at this end and we also have a solid slab on this end so i'll also show you how to use this template to now perform a rib slab as you can see there a, a, sorry a, a rib slab detailing and also other kind of slabs too and then we'll also show you how to perform a um this using this template now perform a column a uh, a column de detailing as you can see from the sample here so i'll show you how to um get all this get all these using this thing as you can see that this is the column um detailing which is very very perfect as you can see there so i'll show you how to use this template now perform your column social detailing and also for your slab um detailing too as you can see there right now although we have already done a lot of videos on the using this thing so you also that you can check all on most of our videos and watch all that i also show you i also show you how to how to now group your beams as you can see that this beam has, has has already been grouped so i'll show you how to group your beam from what we have here i'll show you how to group your beam and all that okay so right now i think we have come to the end of this video series right now which in, which in the next series right now i'll show you how to now arrange all your all your de detailing to this very standard as you can see it here okay so thank you so much and god bless now if you have watched this video and this video looks very very okay for you and it has helped you a lot i would say that you should um click on the subscribe button and subscribe to our channel and also click on the like button and like this video okay so thank you so much and god bless you all we love you